Talk about serene, the Gunpowder River and Gunpowder State Park, a great place for a day of fishing. But before coming out here, you need to get the right fly. The wings are tied tent style over the back of the bug. Snip the legs, little red beady eyes. It's been a lot of work, good work, and I'm happy to have it, but a uh, lot of work, brood ex cicada. While Jeff Brennan has been busy tying the flies, Great Feathers owner Michael Watrous has had a hard time keeping them in stock. Because I don't know how long they're gonna last. Well, I should have one, right? It's a spectacle. It's bizarre. Um, these flies are kind of gross. People that don't like bugs are gonna be freaked out. Um, but at the same time, you know, you don't have to be a good fisherman to use a cicada pattern and catch fish. Everything eats these, and when I say everything, I mean everything. Carp, bass, smallmouth, trout, chubs, musky. And then you're just going flat. Yep, perfect. Theo Lagarde, the owner of Backwater Angler, tells me how the flies work. And it looks close enough to trick the fish, and these cicadas are bad flyers, so they end up in the water, and they become food for the fish that way. So I'm hoping to learn this sport and catch a wild brown trout. These cicadas uh, are present on the river. They have been so for about six weeks, but the fish eat as much as they can, and then they just take a break. And it's like moving to the couch after you've had a slice of pizza. So they're waiting to get everything digested, and then they'll start feeding again. I'm betting on hungry fish. And then we're just gonna flick it out that way. Oh, okay. Just flip it. Perfect. Star student. Star student. Did you hear that? I give it a shot, actually a lot of shots, or casts as they say, nothing. Now see there's a fish eating right next to you, you see that? Yeah. Maybe I just can't find the right spot. Cicadas are in the water, my pattern is a good imitation, so what's the problem? Other people are catching fish with the patterns. I've been fishing all day, nothing, what happened Theo? I think they've already eaten Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> they had their breakfast and their lunch. These fish will be set through the fall, you know, in the next spring. They're putting on a lot of weight right now, and now they're gonna have to work it off all winter. Well, I've got 17 years to practice and hoard these fly patterns till the next time these little buggers come flying through. Lisa Robinson, WBAL, TV 11 News.